Dear Mama, did you see it? Last night, we went from talking about the Bulls to getting in the ring with them. We showed our first picture at the Ever Beach Drive-In. You always told me I would be successful no matter what I did. When the world threw me hurdles, you put me on your shoulders. They don't know how hard it was to get here, but you know it all. You always beat yourself up for the mistakes you made, but to be honest, I wish you were here to make all those mistakes again. They ask me who I am, why I'm doing this and where I'm going. Let's tell them everything. Let's tell them about the offspring of parents on dope. Let's tell them about being born deaf in one ear. Let's tell them about walking to school in the rain, trash bags like ponchos to a speech pathologist because nobody understands what the hell I'm saying. Let's tell them about the uncontrollable asthma week after week in ER. I remember trying to pretend I was okay during an asthma attack because I didn't want to miss going to the movies. Let's tell them everything. Let's tell them about the car that hit me on my birthday, flying half a football field away and the asphalt ripping my ear off. Let's tell them how I'm not supposed to be here. Let's tell them how we grew up sleeping head to toe countless siblings, siblings and cousins in one bed, and you letting me sneak out the room to watch Nick at Night and Turner Classic Movies until three in the morning. Let's tell them how this fish in a tree could never measure up to what school said a student should be, and you wouldn't hear that. Let's tell them about the heart of a gold you made me promise to never lose. Let's tell them everything. Let's tell them how the single mother, trauma survivor, raised a man to live with conviction. Tell his genuine story, no cap. Let's tell them how I loved to learn and that's all because of you. Let's tell them how a kid that couldn't read went from resource classes to college dorms. First in the family, all by chasing dreams. The cinema was the first place in life I ever got to feel intelligent. Now I'm building a cinema where no kid ever misses that feeling. This fish in a tree found water and swam the world, mama. I wish I could have shown you Eva. This place is special. I asked the universe to give me three things, a house by the beach, students to teach, and a story to tell. It listened and delivered me ever. When I got here, I knew immediately this was where I was meant to pour my love into. This was where my cinema under the stars was meant to be. I learned all about this Hoff framework thingy blowing up out here and I bought in immediately. I'm making a movie theater, mama and it's better than I ever imagined it could be because I'm not doing it alone. I shared my baby with others and she's not just going to be safe, she's going to thrive. My fear, my fear is someone else is supposed to be doing this. Someone way better than me, more skilled and capable of pulling off this endeavor is supposed to be leading these teenagers but they just got me. My fear is we not gonna get what we supposed to be because I don't lead them properly, because I don't hear them, I don't listen to them when they speak, because I'm not navigating the ship correctly and we run aground. But I don't let fear talk too long. Fear is the voice of accountability telling me I will answer for everything I put into this theater, and the proof will be in the pudding. Everything done to manifest this dream will be combed through and questioned. Strangely, that same fear puts a fire under me to bring my most selfless and thoughtful energy into every person and every component of this cinema. 
And these students give me a bottomless well of confidence that that fear in the back of my head itching ain't gonna get the best of me. Your boy did it, mama. Folks tell me I'm making you proud. Your boy is doing it. No more talking about the Bulls. We getting in the ring with them. <laughs>